Ladies, gentlemen, houseplants of the internet, I'm Harold McDarrell, let's play Fallout 4. For this series, I'll be trying to stick to the main quest line and not let myself get distracted by side quests or exploration. I will be keeping in conversations along the main path, however I will be speeding those up so we can get more done during an episode. Let's begin. Bethesda Game Studios presents... I'm gonna try not to interrupt this. War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing. It's that war. War never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Alright. Character creation time. Looks like I am done making my character. There they are. And if you want to find out how I exactly got this character done, uh, I will be posting a character creation video uh, probably alongside episode 2. You'll have all the different settings I mess with, but let's uh, continue. Confirm character. Alright. That Mr. Handy. Zooming around and whatnot. And you will probably notice uh, some performance issues. It's simply because my system is a little bit under spec for this game. Uh, It's unfortunate, but uh yeah. Ah, good morning, sir. Your coffee. One hundred and 
I'm gonna do my best to bring quality gameplay to you. Thanks, Kazuwa. Of course, sir. Drink some coffee. I'm actually not really a coffee person. I've never had coffee that I uh, that I liked. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Jungle of the Bat Babies. Oh, sound like someone made a sticky. I shall attend to young Shaw. <laughs> you know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. He said that Sean sounded like he made a stinky. How do you know he didn't, like, fall out of the crib or something? I don't know. Can't go assuming. Just... Nuka Cola. Ice cold. Ooh. I want some. Enjoy some uh, television time. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. I just said. Eh. Did it change? Good morning, Vault Tech calling. Okay. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's um, a matter of utmost urgency. I, eyes are up here, bud. Eyes are up here. He's looking at my pants. It's a little creepy. Uh, okay, wait, urgency? What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language. The big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid. And coming sooner than you may think. If you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a... Uh, you know, How do you know I'm busy? Precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for... Stop looking at my pants. ...into the local vault. Vault 111. It was built in my backyard. I already know. Also, he, 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 he keeps looking at my pants. That's not cool. Uh, enough space. No pants. It's for my entire family, right? Of course. Of course. Minus your robot, naturally. Because robots aren't people. You're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Yeah, because that had all the confidence in the world. <laughs> all right, uh, script. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future under. You're still looking at my pants. Stop it. It's our passion. Sure, let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Stop now, it. Nope. Let's see. Okay. Of course. Wow. Heraldo. Now, I looked up the uh, perk listings, and I got a basic idea of what I want. And the details, I'm going to try to post those in the description for what exactly I'm trying to go for. So, yeah. These are the stuff. Yes. Alright. But yeah, the idea is I want to get all the, the mod stuff you know, for weapons and armor, um, as well as, I believe it was strong back. I want to be able to carry a lot of things. Wonderful. That's everything. I'm uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the... Go away. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. He's creepy. Like a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Except he was creepy. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Right. Sir, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. Yeah. You heard Codsworth. Go on. Okay. 
gets me away from Mr. Creepy. Huh. Special. Wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Probably someone wicked cool. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Okay. Um. Yeah. Look at that smile. Look at that hey, smile. How's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. That sounds right. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir, Mom, you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? Followed by, yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have. We do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Okay. Oh my God. We we need to get to the vault now. Time to run. Let's go. Residents of right up. Let's go. Hills, if you are registered, run. To vault 111 immediately. <sighs> See, people obsessed with all their stuff. Head to the gate, vault participants, check in there. That's absurd. I am not on the vault tech. You don't get in. I'm going in. You're not you vault tech. You're just a guy who works for vault tech. Okay, okay. Someone with a minigun. If you're in the power program, armor, step forward. Otherwise, return home. All right. Um, we need to get in. Hi. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult yes, I am. female. Wait. Oh, you talk. Oh, okay. You. Yeah, don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Or there. Yeah. Okay. What's gonna happen we're good. to all those people outside the gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Oh, a bit of choppiness, but uh. We're Step on the platform in the center. Okay. Right here? Not the edge, or just Almost outside there. of the platform? We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! And I should be blind about now. And Hold on. Sh so should she. Go faster, go faster, go faster, and haircut. Okay, um... We did it. We made it. Miraculously. Okay. Physics Everyone, did not up apply the up there. And proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Well, but give us a moment. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... No, no, We'd all don't be. get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. Okay. Stay stay with me. Hold on. Just a moment. Okay. Sir? Mail. Yes, um... We just kind of... We'll got get everyone the... through this as uh, quickly as possible. Just head up the stairs. Sir. Sure. We just ran here, and then a bomb went off, and we almost got caught in the blast. Everyone, wait. He's fired. You're fired. Here for you. All residents, please proceed. Mail. One 
Now just head down the hall. Welcome Idiot. Home. Female and Good. Each of you take over one there. Of take a Your suit. Brand new yeah, suits. Looks fine. Just step over yeah. to the table. Okay. It's um, down the hallway right thanks. there. Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Look follow at that. Me. My wife breaking the rules. See? This is a rebel. Home. Oh, you're gonna love Stepping it. outside the line. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others That's why are I married great, her. mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My Sir? mother and father down in DC. Oh God, honey. What if they didn't make How it? long do you think we'll be down here? Long. Oh, That's what we're doing, okay? Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a good thing. None, none of these people in Vault Tech really have any people skills. What are these? Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Shouldn't I put the vault suit on before I? It'll be okay. Daddy's right here. See? Who's my little hey, guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. Yeah, there see? he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set. Just step inside and put on your vault suit. Yeah. But really, I should put the vault suit on before I go in, right? Oh, I guess I just did. The pod will decontaminate See? and depress. Breaking rules too. Before we head deeper in the vault, just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. That light shining above is like. Occupant vitals. Normal. That whole thing is just gonna Procedure get ripped complete. up and abducted Eight. by aliens or something. Five. Oh, cryo storage. Interesting. said manual override so this is the one here open it okay he's got a gun she's dressed differently and he's got a gun and he's dressed is it over? I'm okay. almost everything's gonna be fine Um, avoid struggling over a baby. Okay, she has now been shot. And Kraus is back up. Back up. Sounds like something to do with blood, except has to be living blood? Living... I don't get it. <coughs> they wanted Sean for some reason. They would prefer Sean over you know, one of the adults. So it has to be something to do with like fresh come on there has to be a release yeah it's right there oh wait come on come on come on oh god I'll find who did this and I'll get Sean back I promise it's like rush, 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 and then. Hmm. 
Well, it looks like this place is failing, but... Huh, maybe I'll be able to come back later and, uh... You know, fix something and... I mean, she's still frozen. She is still frozen. I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, I think I should probably get moving. Alright. Got more storage. Not uh, accessible. We're gonna go ahead and pick up everything. Might be useful. Alright. Okay. Well. Alright. So, from what I can gather from the various logs uh, shown throughout the vault, this place was meant to. I don't think I hit. This place was meant to, uh, as, as an experiment, to find out just what happens when people are cryogenically frozen for extended periods of time. What happens to the people? Of course, they didn't expect the... well, they didn't expect not to be uh, let out after a while, so... Huh? Oh. What's up, dude? Is this all that's left? Yeah, didn't have any uh, equipment on or anything. Oh, here we go. Pit boy. I like the amount of uh, detail they put into these things. Now you actually see having it put on and everything. Sixty four K RAM? So much. Anyway, all right. I did pick up a number of things along the way. Okay, W and S can go back and forth. AD can switch between those. Alright. Ah, yeah. oh, it's just... It's goosebumps, really. Hit the button. Okay, I'll stand way back. I like how calculated everything is, and then for this, it's just drop. <laughs> That's like super bright. Alright, well, 
Looks like that's it for, uh... Man, I wonder what happened to the stupid people. Alright. Okay, do I want to change anything? I'm just gonna go over everything. 633, of course. Uh, check my appearance. Alright. Yeah, I would say, uh, I would say that's good. Character is gonna confirm. Let's get out of the vault. Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. All right. Very, very bright. Pressure, different light, the shock of seeing all of this. Wow. It's the path it took to run up here, and now. Yeah, things aren't uh, so alive anymore. Alright then, and that about wraps it up for this episode of Let's Play Fallout 4. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more content that I'll be bringing to you very soon. I'll be posting links in the description where you can find Fallout 4 among other things. Until then, make sure to keep yourselves hydrated and get plenty of sunlight my little houseplants. I'm Harold McDarrell, signing off. The <laughs> message of love.